All evidence is in. Jurors preparing to decide what happened when Jonathan Farrell ran toward Officer Wes Carrick, who shot him 10 times. The DNA profile that I obtained from the swabbing of that stain matched the DNA profile obtained from Jonathan Farrell. The defense called DNA analyst Eve Rossi last to point out Farrell's blood on the officer's gun, an effort to back up what Carrick testified last week, that he thought Farrell was a home invasion suspect who was trying to take his gun. She pointed out Farrell's blood on Carrick's uniform, consistent with Carrick's claim that Farrell ended up on top of him after he fired the first shots and kept advancing. No matter what I did, he wouldn't stop. I wasn't sure how many rounds I had fired. None of them affected him in any, any way. Prosecutors did not have a lot of questions for Rossi during cross-examination. In closing arguments, they're expected to tell the jury Farrell just survived a car crash, was dying in that moment, and trying to stop the repeated gunfire. Farrell's family believes everything will work out. Whatever the courts decide, I do want justice. But there's not just justice on earth. Carrick's family told WCCB Charlotte off camera they're satisfied with how the defense presented its case. Courtney Francisco, WCCB News.